Can you find the number of solar panels needed? Well, in this video, we'll find the number of solar panels needed with just four steps. The first step is to find the total watt hours. Now, how can you do that? So we have here three nine watt LED lamp used for six hours per day. So you will take 3 multiplied by 9 multiplied by 6. And in the second part you have 270 watt air cooler used 4 hours per day. So you will take 2 times 70. So this is what multiplied by 4 which is hours. And for the third thing also, we will do the same. But in this case, we have one 120 watt refrigerator that runs 24 hours per day with a compressor that runs 10 hours. So what will we take? We will take the compressor only. We will not take this 24 hours. So we will have here 1 times 120 multiplied by 10. So here we will have 1200 watt hours and here we will have 560 watt hours and here we will have 162 watt hours. Now we will add these watt hours to get a total of 1922 watt hours. So this is the first step. We got the total watt hours which is 1922 watt hours. Now let us head to the second step. In the second step, we will find the total watt hours needed from the PV models. Now what does this mean? Well, when you have a solar panel like this and you tell the solar panels that you need 1922 watt hours the solar panel will not give you 1922 watt hours because it has some losses so how much should we give each solar panel to get 1922 watts So assuming that, uh, or in general, the solar panel will have a loss of 30%. So what will you do? You will take our watt hours, which is 1922 watt hours. You will add by 30% of our watt hours. Or what can you do also? You can just take directly this number here which is 1922 and multiply it by 1.3 all these two answers will give us 2498.6 watt hours now we have done the second step we got 2498.6 watt hours now let us go to the third step Now in the third step, we will divide the total work hours by the panel generation factor. We will divide by this panel generation factor to get the total work watt peak rating. So this will help us to get the number of panels that we want. So the panel generation factor varies from countries to countries. Some countries have it as 2.93, some countries have it as uh, 3.5 and some countries also have this as somewhere around 3.4. But we will consider 3.5 which is the panel generation factor for Oman. So we will take 3.5 panel generation factor. And we will divide our watt hours which we got 2498.6 divided by 
Now when we calculate this, this will give us the total watt peak rating. So let's just calculate this. This will give us 713.9 watt peak. Now this is the third step. We got the watt total watt peak rating as 713.9 watt peak. Now for the final step, we will take the total watt peak rating, which is 713.9 watt peak, divided by the watt peak which is given in the question. So in the question we are given the watt peak as 110. So you write here 110. So when we calculate this, we will get somewhere approx approximately 6.4. So whenever you get a decimal like this 6.4, rise it up to the next decimal. So the next decimal is 7. So just take 7. Even if you get 6.1, take 7. So the answer here will be 7 panels needed. This here will be our final answer.